Alright, what's up guys, it's Joe the Pro here back at it again with another video. Before this video starts, please drop a like on it, subscribe, hit the post notification bell. And what we are doing today, I'm just going to show you guys how to clean the smoothing pads on the Kegel Lane Machine. I've had this question a lot lately by the viewers. Alright, so basically here's your oil roller right here, and then you have these smoothing pads that level it out, I guess. That's how you phrase it. So if you look here, you get all this dust and stuff that picks up off the lane. These ones aren't bad right now because I cleaned them re a couple days ago. But um, you can see all that stuff in there. And that affects how the oil goes out on the lane. So you want to try to keep these as clean as possible when you're running the machine. Now, I'm, I'm going to be showing you guys how to properly clean them in this video. So some guys i've heard take these screws out because that's how you remove the pads and then they actually take them out and wipe them off like that well there's a lot easier way to do it so you first you need a shop vac like how i have here and you just need like a plastic knife so all you got to do is just get the knife in here and go and suck it up with the shop vac and if you do that like every every other time you oil or every um, two times you oil depending on how many lanes you have it should keep them pretty clean the only time you should have to take those out is when you're changing the pads so I'm just gonna show you how to do this it's pretty straightforward so if my shop vac will turn on so you just I usually start at this side it helps if you have a if you cut the end of your shop vac hose like that so you can go on an angle so just work your way, try to get as much of it as you can. See, if you, you can see it down in there, it's all clean. There's no need to take them out of there. The middle part's the hardest part to get. I feel like a dentist. All right, so when you get over here, just move that over. And then I usually switch hands here. Let's go the other way. After you get in between the pads, I usually just go and go all around here, suck up any debris you see. Get in between the oil brush here. Mm. 
I just keep it right here in the Velcro, so then I never forget it. And that's basically it. Um, the only thing you're looking for really is to see if um, the pads are starting to unpeel. Like, these ones seem pretty good. But if they start unpeeling on you, that's telling you that you have to change them out. And yeah, so I hope this video helped everybody who asked. Um, it's the easiest way I found doing it. So please subscribe for more content. Twitter, Instagram, links in the description below. So please drop a like and subscribe and peace. Do it like a pro. We'll see you guys in the next video and drop any requests down in the comments.